if I lose myself Spend a couple days with nobody else Holding in my breath just to see if I can find you in my dreams Oh, I'm getting tired of losing faith And everything I see The beauty in the stars above The last day holds up me Cause I'm a sinner I'm not to say
since 1991. Birds and people are living together in seemingly perfect harmony. Until one day, a young man catches fire. This is Phoenix. Yeah.
Hello and welcome back to the ECPI Rams channel. Thanks for joining us tonight. My name is Ryden, and I'm a member of the Rams stream team. Uh, tonight we're casting our smash team competing in the 2024 ECAC spring season. Uh, before we continue though, did you know that if you have an Amazon Prime account and you have it linked to your Twitch, you get a free twitch.tv subscription? That's pretty lit, huh? So if you can, we invite you to use that free subscription on the ECPI Rams channel to help support our Rams. All proceeds go directly to the esports program. Today, I'm joined by Coach James. Why don't you tell us about yourself, Coach? Hey, Ryan. Thank you for having me. Uh, like I said, my name is Coach James. I run the uh, ECPI Rams eSports teams, uh, not just Smash, but all the other ones as well. Uh, but before we get into the action tonight, we would like to take a quick minute and thank the ECPI Rams sponsors, uh, HPO and, and Game Fuel. We'll be right back. Welcome back to tonight's stream, everybody. Tonight's match features our ECPI Rams versus the Paul Smith Bobcats. Now, if you're a current student at ECPI University and you'd like to try out for the Rams, please go to ecpi.edu slash esports slash tryouts and follow the six easy steps to schedule your trial today. That's right. Among those uh, steps, it says sign up for our Discord. So if you join the Discord and you see Coach James there at the top right, Give them a message. I will give you your permissions, and you can you can figure out also a way to get you tried out. But tonight we have three ECPI Rams players taking the field. First up, we have Hyrax. Hyrax uh, last season played a mean fox, but uh, he also has been playing some Rob. I saw him play something. Oh, I think it was Ganondorf last last week. So be on the lookout for that. He's getting his bachelor's in mechatronics. All right, next up we have Blue Legend Arrow, our new player this season. You can expect him to be playing Sora or Inkling whenever he is up. Blue is going for his associates in electronics engineering. All right, and then we got, last but not least, we got Windrift, our Joker player last season, but he's been picking up a mean Sephiroth. I expect the shirt to come off, and he is getting a Bachelor in Business Administration. All right, excellent, excellent. So how do you feel about tonight's matchup, Coach? I'm feeling good. I, I really, I really like the team that we uh, we have here, and it looks like they're doing a button test real quick, so we have some time. But yeah, the team has been coming along around nicely. All three of our players are very good at this game. Um, you never know what we're gonna get going into ECAC. Last week we uh, actually faced the we were the seed one, and then we faced seed two, and we actually lost to them last week. So I'm hoping the guys can bring it back and full win for us tonight. 
Yeah, that sure was a close game, man. That I I enjoyed watching every moment of it. Yeah, it was it was stock for stock. Everybody was, you know, super close. They had a Bowser that uh, that yeah, the Bowser surprised <laughs> me. That surprised me. He was their best player, and he he was uh he was, he was cheesing a little bit with Bowser, but he was he was doing it well. And they did. We ended up getting defeated. So now we are four and one in the season. Uh, look, looking here to make it five and five and one. The team we're yes, facing sir. tonight, I believe they are four and two. So four and it's two. Yep. A close match. Yeah. So it should be a pretty high octane match tonight. Looking forward to what we get to see on the opponent's team. No idea what they're going to be playing. So it's always a good surprise. Not a clue. It's I I, I try to do the the best research that I can, but unfortunately i it, you have to find the each school stream and their varsity team or the jv team and it's it's definitely difficult uh but we'll we'll see what we got going going in here definitely looks like they're gonna be are they are they doing the latency test here go find matt uh no i think this is round one this is gonna be round oh. one all right awesome we're getting right into it all right so what are you thinking tonight? You gonna see, you think we're going to see some fast characters, some slow characters, some tanks? I think we're going to see something in between on the uh, opponent's team. I'm sure. Uh, honestly, the tank, I've seen a lot of uh, tanky boys come out in the e ECAC meta. I, I, I say it's meta, but it, the online is kind of filled with big tanks, and that's because you can just kind of get lucky hits, and they do a ton of damage, and if you're not careful, they can send you off the edge to your death. Yeah, I noticed uh, last week, Bowser was making use of those platforms on um, Battlefield stage, where he was able to get the grab at high enough damage. I think the damage I saw was 89%, and he grabbed him and landed on the top stage there um, of the platform, and Sent him flying straight up, and he was out of the map. Instant KO. Bowser can almost 100 to zero. Well, I wouldn't say 100 to zero. I'd say if you're at the 50% range, he is a, a scary guy to be, you know, tangling with. Oh yeah, yeah. And, that spinning shell yeah. movie has was was uh was our Achilles heel. Yeah, uh, the out of shield, the out of shield spinning shell. He'd shield, and then he would uh spinning shell move, and it just took like 30 percent each spin so mm -hmm. it's rough but yeah Indeed. i'm excited i'm excited to see uh what we get to play against tonight we doing map bands right now i believe so i believe uh higher axe is doing the map bands for us so we're just trying to we're waiting to figure out what we're going to be playing on round one excellent who do you think uh well i i kind of know the i kind of know the answer but i'm not gonna give anything away who do you think we're gonna okay. see first uh right Mm. Not for us, that's a tough for us. one. That's a tough one because all three players are very, very similar in skill level. They're all, dare I say, equal in skill. Mm -hmm. You know, and from what they've told me, it seems to be the case too when they're practicing. So there's not really a clear like winner to to head it up, but I don't know. I'm I'm thinking they're gonna do high racks as the opener. Okay. Okay. A valid valid uh argument hyrax uh plays that the box. veteran he is the vet oh wow you called it man there's the box yeah there we go box versus richter excellent so richter richter's got some some pretty good moves a pretty good move set he's he likes to play the spacing game a little bit um and fox likes to run at you so yes it's going to be a battle of who can space better Mm hmm. And who can get right it? If, if Fox can get in and get his, his combos going, we see it. Here, it's already coming yeah. out. Yeah. Yep. Nice. Yeah, you can see him trying to keep the distance. He's just trying to. He's trying to. The Richter's trying to keep him away with that whip. And then as soon as the whip lands, you can see he starts. He starts mixing it up. There's a couple axes, a little firebomb. Right. Now, Fox does have a deflector. He can deflect uh, that, the spinning axe. Or sorry, I don't think it's like an axe. Any projectile, really, he can, he can mm -hmm. deflect. So, it might come into play. I know Hyrax really likes the 
you know, the quick jabs into confirms. So mm -hmm. maybe not. Good edge garden coming in from Irax there, unable to get the third one. Oh, that <laughs> the boomerang. <laughs> Super annoying. Boomerang, the chain, axes. Gotta be careful. Yeah, he's just he's just a projectile character. And if you can get in close, it's a confirm. You can just do like that. that. Yep. Alright, now an excellent job on the first stock there. It was a very even fight. Yeah. It's it's looking this guy <laughs> he's oopsies he knows this is an intent so honestly last year when we played uh, we went up basically only against projectile players any just we fit trainers Richters uh, shoot what are they called uh, the Bowser Jr. anybody Ooh, unable to recover and it's just because it's annoying and safe yeah makes sense. Definitely makes sense. But it looks like Hyrax is getting the better of his opponent. Yeah, if he can play a, play the safe game here, he might be able to take the third stock without that losing his first would one. would be ideal, wouldn't it? <laughs> that would be. Well, that was almost it right there. Ooh, that could be... Oh, I thought he was going to up smash him there. Up smash? Yeah, I thought the up smash was coming as well. Oh, I don't think he'll he's Ooh. one more. He might not be able to recover here. Yeah, Richter has the problem, the common problem with the, his character archetype is that he can't. His recovery is not the best. Yeah, Box very, gets a clean, wow. clean finish. Very clean. Nicely done by Hyrax. And GG's to the opponent. GG. Yeah, he does keep all three stocks. That's super important. Uh, he gets to go in with a fresh three stocks. He gets, like he never Like he never fought at all. Let's see if he can run the gauntlet. We do know that these this team has is four and two, so they are no joke. They are they are up there in the ECAC bracket. So we gotta Absolutely. assume that the next player going in is is tough. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I think that they were very evenly matched there for that first stock, and and then um, Hyrax kind of like. He adapted to the play style of of the uh, Richter player. Yeah, he Quickly found the space, that, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And he, he just wasn't able. Richter wasn't able to recover. The player wasn't able to recover, unfortunately. I, I mean, once Fox gets in there, once Fox finds an opening in the in the uh, projectiles and is able to get onto the Richter, it's it's really hard to disengage as the Richter. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, you could see yeah. that when he was kind of juggling him up in the air. Yeah. And uh, uh, keeping him off the map there. And like you said, I mean, Richter's, he doesn't have the best recovery either. So that was, that was tough for him to recover. I was surprised he recovered that one time. He made it though. Me too. Me too. I did not, by the way, did not see a single reflect come out of Fox. I mean, he was, he just, he doesn't like reflects and he doesn't like <laughs> the laser. He doesn't like the laser. No, he just doesn't like laser things like the just... laser reflector or the laser blaster. <laughs> Just pure, <laughs> pure fist and feet. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Pure speed, pure fist and feet. Pure brawling is basically the <laughs> the way he's playing it. Speed, strength, and fury. No gimmicks. Yep, I love it. It's always fun to watch. That's for sure, because you kind of know what what's going to happen, uh, what what his goal is, and you can kind of see him adapting to the players as he as he goes against them like he did in that first game there. He did adapt well to the the Richter, uh, but it also makes him more readable that he's not going to do any of the the weird stuff the Fox can do like the laser. That is a caveat. There. Yeah. So then he'll have to adapt himself. He'll have mm -hmm. to like okay, they they're reading me and I got I got to change it up go some, for some Ooh, grabs or something. Zelda. One, Zelda's a Should good character. Do you think we're going to see Zelda or Sheik most of the time? <laughs> it's, so in this game, it's only... I'm pretty sure it's just Zelda. You can't switch. Oh, is it really? Switch. Okay. Yeah. I wasn't aware of that. There is a Sheik character that you can play, but there is Zelda is a single character. I probably knew that and just forgot, but yeah. You're thinking Brawl, where she can change in between. Where she can change down B. Yeah. I think her down B is the giant soldier now. That's what that. That's that right there. Ah, uh, okay. She can hold it, and then it just 
crosses like, the map, it. swings the big sword, yeah. Ooh, nice, nice back kick air. from Zelda. Wow. Yep. Zelda's got a lot of kill confirmed moves, actually. Um, her back air, like you just saw, the giant soldier. Ooh, there's the <laughs> kill confirmed uh, for Fox, though. Very nice. It's just, it's, this again, it's a space, oh, it's a spacing game. Zelda's got a little bit more range with her, you saw her little magic hands. Mm hmm. But, you get a nice combo. He's got nice. her stuck in a combo right now, excellent. Drops it though. Yep. Getting her back in it, nope. That's kind of interesting. Yeah, it, she's up being to stop the combo, but then it leaves her vulnerable when she lands. Yeah. It's a risky move, risky move there. Oof. Fox is able to get back That's on it. the edge. Oh, Ooh, there it is. Nice try. Very good recovery oh. from Zelda. There it Into is. Into almost a kill confirm. Good try by Zelda. Great trying recovery. To get the, yeah. Trying to get that spike. Doesn't get it. Yeah. Ooh. Very close. Okay. Nice shield. Ooh. That is great. That thing comes out fast at upbeat. Yeah, it does. Nice spot dodging from both players. It's a little yeah, half soldier going. <laughs> Very nice kick. Now, they I don't both... think he's going to be able to hold on to this life. I think I think the Zelda player is going to, yeah, going to take him out there. But that we we have a good last last stock battle here. That's right. And I mean, we've been leading the stock battle, so we're in a good spot. We're in a good spot. Even if he drops the stock, we're in a good spot. But I want him Great. to win. Me too. Okay, okay. Very nice. But little little spot dodging, little spacing. Yeah, throwing her off guard a little bit. There's the first fireball in the game. I'm surprised. <laughs> I haven't seen any of those. Uh, super good tool. So if Fox ever gets knocked off the edge, you'll, you'll see her throw a fireball. But actually, yeah. she hasn't really thrown one, so. To That's be fair, Fox is. It. Yeah, it is. It, so if Fox gets knocked up into the air off stage, it's really good because you can control it, make it go up, and like, mm -hmm. uh, hit him. But uh, down low, it's really hard to connect. So you should probably gotcha. have to. Yeah, because he's been recovering from down low pretty much every time. Yeah. All right, this might be it, folks. Oh, and it it's a spike for the win. Dang. GG's. <laughs> well done. I saw it coming. I saw it coming too. Yeah, Dang. I think he did. I think he did too. He just didn't have didn't have time to react there the way that uh, he was left after that last attack. Yeah, he could have recovered a little bit lower and upbeat into it, but I'm not sure if Zelda's kick cancels out the uh, the Firefox move. That's a good question. But that is a either really way, good question. Either way, GG's Hyrax. GGs we got our indeed. next next guy going in. So, All right, so who do you think is going to be next? Uh, well, I guess I can't ask you that because you, you already know, don't you? <laughs> I don't know, but I have a feeling. I can guess, make an educated guess. All I right, think, what's, your, uh, what's your educated guess? I think it's going to be Blue coming in with okay. uh, either Inkling or Sora. Either one's really good here. It's, again, again another rushdown character that will make Zelda sweat. Zelda is good at scrapping up close, but not like, not like a rushdown character is. Very true. Yeah, I think um, we're going to see that as well. The other alternative is, uh, you know, Joker could come out or uh, from uh, Ganondorf. We saw Ganondorf from blue. We saw him for Ganondorf from blue. Ganondorf would not be good here. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't think I don't think that'd be the best matchup. <laughs> It'd be cool. You know, Ganondorf versus Zelda. Ganondorf versus Zelda. <laughs> oh, yeah, absolutely. But no, nah, no. Nah, nah. All right. Looks like I was correct, and we were correct. We're going with the Sora. Indeed. All right. And Zelda's got one stock remaining, so she's going to jump off the map here a couple times, and they're going to emote. All right. Remember, this is a, a, a uh, shoot, what are they called? A team battle. Not a team battle. Shoot. I don't remember what it's called. It's a team battle where each player has three sets of lives, and that's all they get, no matter even if they win their match. Oh, okay. Yes. But yes, best I'm blanking of three. on what what that is called. Best of three, though, yeah. So if 
All we gotta do here is kill the Zelda once, and then the uh, other team will only have one character to choose from. Doing a good job right now, keeping her on the defense. Ooh, what a prediction from Sora. Oh, there's the thunder. Nice. I hate that move. Me too. It's so good. Oh, it is very good. Another beautiful prediction. Sora expecting the Zelda to Ooh. come in. What oh, a snag. Stops the upbeat. snag right there. Oh, close one. Tried to predict. And he gets the counter Great off. counter. Excellent plays coming in from Blue there. Blue is playing very patiently, waiting for the Zelda to make mistakes. Kind of just standing there, waiting for something to happen. That, that was a very smart way to play it. Commend him for that. Empire's All right, well. want to go in there and just get it get it done and try and attack full force. He was playing it smart, playing it patient. I mean, he, he only had to get one to stock, win. right? So he kind of is like, yeah. okay, how does she want to play this? So we're going to play it slow, or we're going to play Either, it yeah. fast. Play it fast or play it slow, and I like the slow play there that he did. Yeah. All right, so... The last, the last player that we're going to be seeing, we might not even see this game technically. We don't know yet. But the last player we would see would be uh, Windrift playing Sephiroth or Joker. Right. If Windrift uh, gets a chance to fight in this first round, right? Yeah. Yes. Exactly. I mean, it's we. I the amount of games we've cast, we've seen, we have seen the Rams. Uh, you know, just a player just doesn't get to play because the other two mm -hmm. were able to take all six, not sorry, all nine stocks from the opponent. And that's OK. We, I, I am sure the team here would rather not play and get the win. And have their teammates carry them <laughs> Absolutely. and uh, just secure the win. Good confidence booster, too, for the whole team. Mm. I, I, I believe this is the third place team we're going up against. We're now second place because we lost that one. Yeah. So this is would be like the third or fourth place team. Yeah, the right. uh sorry, okay. the match is about to start here, folks. All right. It's it's a it's a cloud. It is a cloud indeed. We got a cloud versus our Sora. Alright, two sorties. Oh they must have gone to the same barber. Cloud is looking to be the anchor here for his team. Can he take out our sword player? We'll see. Ooh, got a key key versus a sword. Which one's stronger? I mean, they're both in uh, Kingdom Hearts too. You, you get to see Cloud. I'm pretty sure you can play Cloud. In Kingdom Hearts. Mm -hmm. All right, all right. Mm, Looks like pretty even the, yeah. so far. He's got the limit. Ooh, gets hit gets by the limit. limit. I don't know if nice he recovery. Last week, but Cloud did not hit a win at all last Cloud week. did not hit. Yeah. Missed. I think it was five of them. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunate. Oh. Fortunate for us, not so much for them. Ooh. Oh, that gets hit by that side B again. Oh. Got him caught in a, in a little bit of a combo here. Nice. Breaks the combo. Okay. Good to know. Fire deflects. Oh, gets caught. That Ooh. was interesting. Very good play by both players, actually. Oh, nice. my goodness. Very what a well read. done by Blue. A counter off the edge of the stage to secure the kill. Yeah. There's not much you can do about it. Nope. Oh, another counter being thrown out. Oh, if that hits, Sora is going blind. That's, yeah. Oh. Ooh. Uh-oh. <laughs> nice counter there. Great read. Great read. The counter keeps people honest. It, but you can't throw it out too much. There's a good mm. confirm. Good limit. Good, limit, good break. limit break there. That move. Oh. The solid. I did not know you 14 could. 14 damage. I did not know you could. Oh, he is good at spot dodging that move. Might want to throw something else out. Nice. Oh, not he Very makes nice. him makes him spot dodge in the air. I think he's dead. Yeah. Oh, he and he can't recover. Yeah, that's one of the. I, I told you I hate how I hated the thunder because every time I play against the Sora players, they just 
edge guard with thunder and ice. Oh, edge guarding with thunder is fantastic. Oh, nice tech by the cloud, actually. He was dead to rights if he didn't tech that wall. And uh, yeah, that I don't was know if very you know, impressive. Right? You know how the tech works? The wall jump? No, it's not a wall. So if you get hit into a wall, you can spam your shield, like not spam it, but if you hit your shield button right when you hit the wall, it stops you from being sent flying. Ah, okay. Yeah. I did not know that. Oh, I thought he did some, some kind of wall jump or something. That was awesome. Oh, he's going to try to carry him. Doesn't get it. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> Both players are spot dodging for their lives. Yes, they are. Oh. Nice Great throw. Grab. There it is. Yeah, so Sora. And recovery. So you can't you can't ma match Sora's off edge. No, his off edge is crazy. I've seen Blue go under the map and recover on this map. So. True. Okay. Throwing some range attacks at him. Oh, this is that. Did some Ooh. smash for his troubles. <laughs> Good smash. A little bit of lag, it's okay. Hopefully it, hopefully it evens out here. Ooh, trying to get him in a combo. Blue is uh, playing, playing a very patient bit. game. Yeah, playing a little too patiently for my liking. Nice little limit grab. He uses that nice limit to recover. Right? Yeah, that was great. Okay. Good throw. Another throw off the Didn't edge. Didn't have the. He's got the thun the thunder ready now. Yeah. Here it is, Here, thunder. Another up throw. Yeah. He's got. Th he's just waiting on it. Blue's playing a, a little bit too much game. with his lunch here. Yeah. <laughs> He, I, I hope he gets punished for it, if I'm being honest, because... <laughs> nice. Nice counter. Very nice counter. Nice counter. All right, guys. That was round one. The Rams take it. Mm -hmm. And we'll be well right done. back. Welcome back to the stream, everybody. Wow, what a first match, huh? What'd you think about that, Coach? Uh, I, I I thought it was good. Um, both teams were were fighting for dominance. I saw uh, Hyrax putting on a clinic. Lou was uh, using that counter to great effect. Um, oh yeah. I'm hoping that we get to see some more action. Maybe we. I hope when we get to see uh, Windrift play, but maybe yeah, maybe, maybe Windrift will start. Who knows? You could just throw them in, maybe. Yeah. And throw off the opponent, because they don't know. They don't know what our, our third player is. That's very true. They might be going in, changing their characters, planning to play against uh, Sora or Fox first, and comes at him with Sephiroth or, jo or Joker. So. Exactly. Uh, Joker, I mean, he could go Joker. I honestly think Joker would be fine. But I know that Windrift likes to play against uh, some heavy characters when he plays Joker, because he can... Mm -hmm. combo and it's easy to to hit um with sephiroth i mean still you can still see him against heavies but I, we didn't see a single heavy that game so maybe that's not. true we saw <laughs> we we saw cloud so it'd be it'd be kind of cool to see cloud versus sephiroth who's the Z the zelda character the player was pretty good she was she knew uh i liked how zelda was using the upbeat to recover and to uh, dodge abilities or combos coming in from the fox. 
Yeah, like you said, it leaves her vulnerable on her way down, which is kind of a risky move, but it ended up working out in her favor most of the time. I mean, Fox was on top. Like, if he was on the left side of the stage, Fox was literally on top of her, so she would just up, be away, and then be on the right yep. side of the stage. He can't get there that fast, but it gave, True. It, it's not like Fox is in trouble when she does that. It just kind of threw him off a little bit. Yeah, smart plays for sure coming from Zelda there. All right. Looks All like right. we're banning the stages. I'm not sure what stage we'll be on yet, but we are up uh, one round to zero, and it's a best of three. Indeed, indeed. <sighs> so what do you, who do you think you, uh, out of the... Sorry, go, go ahead. ahead. Oh, you got it. Go, go, go for it. I've been talking too much. Oh, I was just... I was going to just ask you, uh, out of the three players that we saw on the other team, uh, which one do you think poses the most threat? I think the Zelda was was pretty good. I, I like the Zelda, how she played. She had the most, honestly, the character's really good, and uh, they seem to grasp uh, where the danger was coming from and what their kill, their win condition was. Um, mm -hmm. But I do think... Uh, we had the slight edge just because we're playing rushdown characters and Zelda kind of struggles against them, but mm -hmm. we shall see how it goes. Yeah, I'm with you on that. I think I think Zelda really did a good job uh, keeping her distance, but not getting too far away and keeping keeping um, you, you know us off of her, making sure that she was able to get out her moves. So well, I'm interested to see what she brings to the table this game. I wonder. Uh, I might. If I was them, I might switch to a to a heavy character to see if I can, you know, get some easy kill kill confirms. Yeah, just just sure. because I know Fox struggle. Like if you get hit once as Fox, you're in trouble. And yeah. Same with uh, same with uh, Sora. That's true. Especially if they that play is... on like one of those stages, right? Like, the the small stages that don't have a lot of room on the outsides or the bottom or the mm -hmm. top can be quick death. That's very true. That is assuming, of course, that they do have experience and skill playing the heavier characters. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna be, if I was playing, I would not have any skill playing heavy characters. It takes. A, it, I actually think it takes more skill to play heavy characters because you're so easily punished that mm -hmm. you have to have the fundamentals down yes um, before you pick them up i mean you can just randomly smash like you know throw a smash attack in and get lucky but more often than not you get you're vulnerable and you get uh you get punished for it yeah no that definitely makes sense yeah like i when i saw the bowser player last week playing i thought oh this will be no no problem right i was definitely uh surprised to see what <laughs> happened that fire, the the fire breathing from Bowser, he, I know. Mm -hmm. I think Fox was again playing against him. It took him from zero to thirty percent just by breathing the fire. And yeah. He couldn't even get out of it, was it. Like that, yeah. And then every time he tried to get in close, which is obviously what he's got to do, spin, spin, spin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, he right. shielded and spinned. All right. All right. We so get... we do have um, wind drift coming out here. Coming it out goes strong. in quick, though, yeah. The big sword has got the space that he needs. Yes. Zelda's a little trying to scrap with him, getting close. I, I, you kind of have to do that as Zelda against uh, Sephiroth. You have to get close. Um, because Sephiroth is actually, even though he looks fast right now, right? He's actually slow. Mm -hmm. He's not really... Yeah, he yeah, you can see in his jumps, really. You can see like it's not he's not a super fast character, that's for sure. Ooh, that, well, that's why he there. is jumping, right? He's jumping because he, it helps him recover. It, the, your, his movement yep. is help with the jumps. He's his little bunny hop, does a those nuts a jab or an attack, and uh, he recovers faster. That uh, Oof. I think is, is that is the down tilt one where he slides on the ground and kicks. Mm. Or is uh, that, down that smash? is the yeah. That's the that's the down tilt. The down smash is okay. the, the big sword thrusting into the ground. Yeah, that down tilt's nice. That one. <laughs> that one right there. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Can he, he recover? 
dead. Oh no, he cannot recover. He missed a jump. <laughs> missed a jump. Happens to the best oh. of us. He actually read that. Read the uh, up the into him. Oh, that ooh, is. Ooh, ooh. That, that is crazy. That was crazy. crazy. <laughs> wow. I did not know that was an interaction. The golem. Yeah, the Stopped golem. <laughs> that was wild. I don't know if she knew that worked or, but it was good. <laughs> that was good. Yeah, I wasn't Dang. expecting it. I don't think uh, I don't think he was either. <laughs> yeah. Nice spot dodge though. Oh yeah, the the, uh, the Zelda uppies are getting a little predictable. There he goes. There he goes. All right, looks like uh, Wind Drift is picking up the pace a little bit. Here comes the, <laughs> the counter. Okay. Can he recover? Yes. That is crazy. It it stops him from recovering because of the it way Sephiroth's up B works. Yeah. Because oh, no. his up B is continuous, it stops him from recovering. If it was in, if it was like an instantaneous thing, it wouldn't stop him. Ooh. And she gets the final hit. Zelda gets the final hit there. Wow. GG from Zelda. Players. Yeah, man. That was wild. That was wild. The use of that, that was actually a really good matchup now that I'm thinking about it. If 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 Zelda knew, but I don't think Zelda knew. I I, I wouldn't be surprised if she did knew she did know that that was an interaction. I just didn't know yeah. that that was an interaction. I don't yeah, think that, uh that's crazy. Yeah, I don't think Windrift knew about that interaction either. But that was that was crazy. I've not seen it before, but right. But I, you can avoid it by recovering low. So instead of recovering, you know, straight like you get knocked off, you recover straight to the side. You just go mm -hmm. low and then up be up to the edge instead of coming from the side. Yeah, I th think that that one time it happened was enough to throw him off there and and put him in a you know on the defensive. Cause, yeah, yeah, it was yeah. it was tough for him to to recover after that. That was so, a good effort, though. Definitely a good it, effort. On the other hand, if he does recover low, you saw the Zelda going for a lot of uh, spikes, right? You saw her going mm -hmm. for the heel, the double heel kick, just trying to spike players. So yeah, lots maybe of it's spikes. maybe it's a re maybe it's a something that he knows about and is practiced. Could be. All right, here comes the All Sora. Right. Here comes Blue. Let's see what he can do. Two SDs to because uh, he took two stocks. Mm -hmm. Here's to hoping uh, Blue here can take down Zelda without losing any stocks. <laughs> There's the... Oh, so you can't... Yes, so that is a thing. That's why one of the reasons I don't like playing Zelda is because you can just attack the soldier before it's formed and it'll break. Oh, okay. Oh, nice counter nice combo by there. Zelda. Zelda saw the counter coming. Watch out. Sorry, the combo. Okay. Can he recover, though? Nice recovery. Fine. Scary, but very nice. Oh, nice. He tried to call her out. She tried to call the roll out, but it didn't work. She didn't roll. She just... Nice shield. Oh, nice match. Nice read. Catches her off guard. Excellent. Blue is GG. able to take her down without losing a stock. GG's to both players, of course. So we are now even Steven. That, that was that took some nerves to uh just stand there and and smash attack like that. But it caught her off oh, yeah. guard. Whew. All right, well, let's see what we got. Maybe the Richter makes a return against the Sora. Yeah, that, that, I think I think that'll probably be what we see. Yeah, we, we already guess. saw. Yeah, we already saw how the matchup went where Sora versus uh, shoot, who's the last character? Uh, Cloud. Yes. It was definitely was just little, going Blue's way. Though. Yeah. Yeah. So I think the Richter makes the most sense. Richter player coming in would make mm -hmm. the most sense, even though eh, it's not a bad matchup. I don't think. I think it's pretty even. Yeah, I'd say so.
The only thing yeah, is, though, a... I know Blue likes his counter, and that chain spam that Richter was doing was is easily, you know, readable, and he could just jump into it and counter it. Oh, I see. That's definitely going to be a problem for Richter. All right. While yeah, I... uh, our teams are doing bands, uh, let's take a quick commercial break. We'll be right back, guys. Stay tuned. All right. All right, welcome, welcome back, back right everybody. How's it going, right? What's what's going on in the stream? All right, so it looks like we are waiting for them to get their map chosen right now. All and Bastion, some, and some music, and some music. Yeah, it's got to be it's got to be the correct music. You can't go, gotta, you can't play Sora on Hollow Bastion. Have the right tunes, exactly, and not have the correct correct music. You have to have that Kingdom Hearts music. <laughs> got to. Oh boy, what a night! What a night! Indeed. Uh, if you're just tuning in, the Rams are. Uh, they won the first round. We're into the second round, and uh, I believe we just. Oh, they they took out we our Sephiroth player. Yeah, we're all even, except for. Yeah, we're all even. You're right. One hundred percent correct. It's two players versus two players. It should be a good one, folks. Yeah. If you don't follow us on YouTube, I'm not sure what the link is. <laughs> but if you search up the <laughs> diorams uh, on YouTube, we post all our um, our vods from Twitch. We post clips, um, past seasons. You know everything is up there. Uh, please go ahead and take a follow and take a look. It's it's fun to watch. Check it out. All right, all right. here we go. All right, looks like we're second right. Game we're... of match two. Three, two or second, one, excuse me, not the second go. game, third game of match two. I mean, yeah. <laughs> two characters. Right. Two characters, yeah, yeah, you get what I'm saying. All right, so we're calling out the Richter. Nice. Yeah, and Richter does not want to be, yeah, he wants to be like medium range, throwing things at you. Nice. See, there's nice the counter, counter I was talking yep, about. There it is. Gets in the flames again. Oh, nice spot dodge. Excellent thunder. Goes oh, for the spike because then I'm able to connect. That recovery was not bad. Oh, oh. <laughs> Blue needs to. I, I'm gonna say. I, I think he can just throw the counter. Like jump into him and just counter. Yeah, he's trying to keep him at a distance, and when he gets in, he's gonna throw his chain. Oh, the axe. That's what always gets me. All right, all right. There's the counter. He's struggling. Now, is He's struggling. Chain, is this chain the, uh, his B move? I don't know. I, I don't think so. I think it's just a smash oh. attack. I think it's a okay. smash attack. The very fast, fast smash. Yes. You can hold it, but he's not holding it. He's just using it for spacing. Gotcha. All right, Blue. Come on. Get in there. There, there you, you go. go. Good slide. Oh, drops the combo. Richter does Recovery, shield it. Picking up distance. There it is. Yep, good grab. Oh, tries to call him out. Doesn't work. Ooh, That's crazy. Gets caught in the fire and gets smashed to oblivion. So he shielded the fire, but the fire is a bottle and it bounced backwards. Oh, that's cool. Oh, wow. It's a good combo. Oh, definitely is. I think Blue's giving him a little too much credit. He's trying to get in there and then throw a counter as like a, a fade. 
like a fake, like, yeah. hey, I'm going to attack you, and then he counters, trying to get him to ca attack him, but... Oh, there there you go. He's, got the, he's got the bottle. I did not know you could grab the bottle. <laughs> he picked the bottle up. Wait. I did not know that either. He got the bottle. Throw it at him. Come on. Do it. <laughs> there it is. Yes. <laughs> nice. Oh, uh, I did not know you could grab the bottle there. That That's cool. epic. I think you have to shield it first and then grab it. I don't I think you can just... Blue, Grab okay, it. you have nice to shield it, it blocks, and then you have to unrelease the shield and grab, I would assume. That is cool. I See, more. we're learning things today. We are. Zelda's soldier blocks uh, Sephiroth, <laughs> a fee, and you can grab Richter bottles. Yeah, that's wild. All right, you just got to get through again. Uh, all the yeah, projectiles, he's get through, man. through his projectiles. Man, that, that axe <laughs> there it takes is. your shield down. There I think that's is. a death. Can't yep. recover. Yeah, you yep. just gotta get. He just has to get through once, and then knock him off the edge. And Sora can chase. Richter does have an okay recovery with chain, um, but it takes a little bit yeah. more skill to to use than Sora's up B, <laughs> which you get three chances to recover. Yeah, that's wild. I love his recovery. It's so good. Oh, good, good spot, spot dodges. Dodge. Breaks the shield. And, and he's going to smash attack to death. Good smash in here. That was not... He charged the wrong move. He went <laughs> for the down smash, I think. Did he really? Yeah, he went for a down smash rather than a side smash. Ah, uh, I see. Unfortunate. Oh. It's okay. He can recover. Oh, he, count, he countered the uh, the boomerang. And it hit, it hit the Richter. There it is. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 there it is. No. Okay. 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 Oh, nice call quite. out. Richter's still in it. One I would like to see Sora. the Sora. Oh, there's the counter. It hits the Richter. That's kind of funny, actually. It actually goes through the counter, and then it on the return trip it hits Richter. Wow. <laughs> oh, he tried to get. He tried to do it again. All right, All right, can Blue Man manage to hang on to his life here? Count counters the fire. Countered Very the fire to go through it so he doesn't get stuck in it and then run and gets the, and then get the, the grab. grab. Yeah. That's well crazy. Done. Learning all Thank kinds of things to tonight. Players. Yes, indeed we are. New techs. Woo! GG's though. GG's, Richter. GG's indeed. Yeah, Richter did a great job of keeping him at a distance there for a while. It, it's hard. Like I said, it was hard for Blue to get in. He was, even though it looked like yeah, he was he playing. Was yeah, even though it looked like he wasn't really trying to get in, he just was trying to read it. Okay. When was the axe falling? When's the bottle coming out? When's the boomerang hitting? There's just so much projectile. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a lot going on. Then you get in close and you give him time to get that chain out. It's back to square one. Yeah. Like I said, I think he's just trying to do what I so he, <laughs> It was interesting. Blue was actually doing exactly what I was saying that he could probably do, which was like mm -hmm. do dodge all the stuff and get in and then push the counter button because as yep. you know, the player throwing the projectiles, you're gonna you're gonna panic, right? And you're just gonna try to attack. Um, yeah, something getting close, but that is not what the Richter did, and it actually worked bad. Went badly for Blue when he threw the counter. Mm -hmm. Whew. Yeah, that was a pretty intense match. I, I didn't I didn't know who was going to win at first with that first stock. It was definitely a, a tight one. Uh, so while we're waiting for the the bands for the maps to come through, uh, what character do you like to play, right? Well, I've always been a Fire Emblem character guy. So like any Fire Emblem character is great for me. Um, I've I like Rob a lot too. Rob is is a lot of fun, <laughs> but Rob I started really out good. with Roy back in the day. Um, and before Roy, it was uh, Captain Falcon and Link. Okay. The original Super Smash. Right. I was yeah. uh in the original Super Smash. I was a Fox player. I just ran at you. Fox was so <laughs> broken. <laughs> yeah, he was really good. He was just yeah, as fast as Captain Falcon, man. And yeah, Oof. I think it was Melee then that uh, Roy and Martha introduced. 
And right. that's when I fell in love with them. Yeah, I, I just love the whole. And then, then of course, Ike. Mm-hmm. You know, yeah, big all the Fireland characters. Oh, Ooh, all right. We got a new, some a, a change in the roster from uh, from Ooh. the enemy team here. Interesting. And Cineroar. Big boy. Big boy and does a lot of damage. And he, his, to balance him out, his recovery is not so great. Well, it's okay. It's just read. It's just readable. Mm -hmm. I, so I have seen Blue play against Incineroar online, not uh, in ECAC maybe, but uh, just you know during practice and online play. When yeah. the Incineroar gets knocked off the stage, you see that bat right there. You can, you know where he's landing, right? Mm -hmm. You can counter it. Like you can just time the counter and just slam him across the map. Oh wow! Oh. The Ooh, command grab, grab gets blue there. Oh, nice grab again. <laughs> oh, your command grab Ed goes Garden through like counter, bro. Command wow. grab goes through counter. You cannot counter command grab. Oh, tries it again though. Okay, okay. Almost pulls it off. He's, He's gonna like grab him <laughs> yeah. as much as he can here, it looks like. Playing like a true sumo wrestler right now. <laughs> yeah. There it is. Oh, he Ooh. tried it. He tried it. Almost got the counter. He was just a little off on his splitting. Okay. Nice. Oh, that's so hard. I hate that move. I still hate that move. <laughs> <laughs> Every time it comes out, I can feel your pain. Oh, he doesn't. He doesn't get punished. He gets grabbed, but no, no death. Oh, Ooh. there's that. Oh, he doesn't command Ooh. grab. Cool. Oh. That's so. That's the counter from Incineroar, by the way. Oh, okay. It just makes him do nice more throw. damage. He tried. Oh, he missed. A little Didn't bit read off. it correctly. All right, here we go. Here we go. For sure this time. Oh, <laughs> oh man. All right, back throw. There Big damage on both. All right, all right. Here we go. Here we go. For sure. Oh, he's gone. Never mind. He's not recovering. There it is. The recovery wasn't. Yeah, it wasn't possible. Okay. Sora is gonna wait out the invulnerability. Gets the spot dodge away. Does smart. He is. The command grab is just not going through. I don't play in center but i'm pretty sure you have to reactivate the second portion of the grab i see okay there Ooh. is yeah, he is not he's still not dead All right goes for the spike luckily sora avoids oh he's just gonna carry him off the edge carries yeah. him off the map yeah yeah yeah, yeah sora okay there you go and then sora gets the smash in I believe we still have, if, if the Incineroar is able to take this last stock from our Sora player, we have a Fox backup still. We do? Yes. We do indeed. And then that would be it. We'd just be Fox versus Incineroar. Right now, though, Sora is fighting for his life. Not to fighting get command grabs. <laughs> He's trying yeah, to avoid trying that command grab. No, there you go. Nice counter. So as soon as the counter goes off, you want to try to get some damage in Essence Center Arc because now you're doing double, I think it's double damage. Really? I think it depends on how much you, how much you absorb. Oh, okay. So we're playing his distance right now. Yep, yep. And Center knows that he has to kind of respect it. There you go. Yeah, he, he cycled through and got the, th there it is. There it is. There's the counter yep. for the win. There's the counter play. GG's! Excellent plays. GG's to both teams. Well done. All right. Excellent. All right. I believe that is it, folks. Uh, are we are we off, Lily, or are we still doing it? We're still alive? Like, I'm still here? All right. Okay. All well, right. I'm still here. Well... <laughs> We'll be right back with a with a player interview, but we're gonna do a quick uh, at sponsor video. But stay tuned for our player interview. I'll see you guys soon. Let us know we got for a team.
All right, welcome back, everyone. And now we're here with Blue Legend Arrow, who is playing Sora tonight. Hey. So, Blue, how you, how you doing, man? Uh, how'd you feel about the match tonight? I think I did pretty well. Um, I'd say the hardest thing would probably be the cloud. Not because I was, like, making it too easy, but I was playing a little bit too patiently, and it kind of got me a little... It almost made me lose the match, though, but I, I knew my friend Winter would have finished that. A little, a little too patient. Yeah, I should have, like, been a, great... a little bit more aggressive. Yeah, absolutely. It was a great showing, though. Great showing. Uh, so yeah. I'm curious, why did you choose Sora as your main character over all the others? And um, I wanted to play Inkling because I've been playing Splatoon three recently. But my good friend, uh, my good friend, uh, Vale of DNL, he was here last week. He he actually mm -hmm. showed me Kingdom Hearts two and one, and I've enjoyed it mm. so much recently. That's actually why I usually pick Veiler Form Sora because it's actually. My second favorite one compared to Final Four, but I like Veil more because of the design. So very good reason. You know. Very good reason. Uh so is there anything in uh in game that you guys would uh you think you want to improve upon or or change? Improve upon? Um mm -hmm. for me, I guess maybe being like I'm trying to be more patient, but I don't want to be too patient, like what happened with the cloud. Exactly. For 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 Fox, for, for Fox Henry. Mm -hmm. Ariax, I mean, <laughs> like he's he's actually really good. Both of my teammates are really good. For for Ariax, I really just say grabbing more, I guess. But he's already doing pretty well. And for Windrift, mm -hmm. um, honestly, I can't really say too much. He plays really patiently. It's pretty impressive. Um, and I don't mm -hmm. really play Sephiroth, so I can't really give the best type of knowledge. So, you know, but I will yeah. say Windrift got cheesed on that match against Zelda. I feel bad for him. <laughs> I was almost like uh, against the Bowser player uh, last week when Hyrax was Fox against the Bowser. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh, man, that the the spinning shell thing seemed a little cheesy to me, but it was really well done. Yeah, it was well done. Very well executed, of course, but it definitely mm -hmm. seemed a little cheesy. It's um, definitely cheesy. It's for one, it's easy to do. It doesn't take that long getting full iframes. It's just a really good move and it's really safe. Too. Mm hmm. So very safe, very powerful. Mm -hmm. Indeed. If I had to say the best heavy, it'd probably be Bowser, just because he's just really good at doing what he needs to do. And Bowser's scary. Sometimes I think I maybe should have chose Sora against him instead on that last match. But yeah, you know, yeah, you never know. Maybe you. There's always next season, right? Yeah, definitely. And we're probably gonna meet playoffs anyway. I'm sure we're gonna go to playoffs, so we're gonna go against him next time, and I'm gonna show him how my Sora goes. Excellent. Well, I'm looking forward to it, and I'm sure everyone else is as well. Thank you. Uh, thank thank you. you, Blue. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Thanks for joining us tonight. Uh, all right, everybody. Uh, thank you so much for being here and supporting us. Uh, once again, join us on Wednesday for some Overwatch. And last but not least, thanks to our sponsors, HP Omen and Game Fuel. Y'all have a great night. You too.
Cry.